day traders, in today's video, I'll be talking about how you can earn massive passive income using Binance DeFi staking. Binance DeFi staking. So you can actually stake DeFi coins on Binance and you will be given reward either daily or during a long period of time depending on what you choose on the platform. So I'll be teaching you that in a moment. Remember this from Mutual Academy. My name is Paradise. This is the home of successful traders so you want to be successful help us smash that like button share the video and ensure you subscribe to the channel and let's grow the academy together thank you very much guys for doing that now let's dive into it what is DeFi? now binance have offered its users you know the opportunity to um, participate in DeFi coins that is you can actually stake your DeFi coin directly on the binance platform either you're using your mobile app or you want to pass through the web you can as well stake your DeFi coins and benefit massively from the different uh, DeFi products that binance offer on its platform so what is DeFi? DeFi means decentralized finance why c5 means centralized finance. now what's the difference the difference is in decentralized finance, nobody takes you know absolute control of the exchange. And CFI, example of DeFi, we have Uniswap, we have Binance Swap, uh, Binance Liquid Swap, we have the Shoshi Swap, and all of those swaps where um, traders provide liquidity, and then you can exchange or swap any coin for another without you know permission or there is no kyc verification there is no financial um, inclusion like inequality in the system and it, it is it, it has a global access that is for DeFi. so DeFi is decentralized finance where the exchange itself is not owned by a particular body or individual so therefore there is no you know that's you know um, high sense of control from the head now we have c5 c5 means centralized finance now we have a lot of c5 exchanges in the world for example binance is a c5 exchange i mean the binance platform this very platform is a c5 platform reason being that is owned by binance and they control what happened on this very platform so if you misbehave they can actually get you out without kyc there are some things you can't do here so it needs a whole lot of verification processes before you can actually participate and trade on the Binance. So Binance itself is a C5 platform that is centralized finance because there is already a head and I believe Binance have a head office as well where all major decisions have been made for the exchange to, to function very well. Now, so DeFi is our main focus for today, and I'm going to show you how to stake DeFi tokens on the Binance platform for massive, massive gain without you trading, without you trading. Okay, so DeFi projects like the DApps, which is decentralized apps, have been uh, fully adopted because of um, two reasons. There are two reasons why DeFi projects it's not in full adoption and number one is lack of public awareness lack of public awareness leads to you know DeFi under development but i believe with recent technology DeFi is coming up very strong and number two is sorry and um number two is non-interactive user interface so the user interface is non-interactive the user interface is non-interactive very very important that is if you go to uniswap right now and um if you want to swap a coin go to binance swap it's not that you know interactive if you've not been mentored and taught how to do certain things you are bound to make um, certain mistakes which is not supposed to be so so these are the two major reasons why um, DeFi projects are not you know fully adopted because of these two reasons so take note of that i believe you've known what DeFi is 
and what C5 is and their various example. I say DeFi, we have example of DeFi, Uniswap, Swap, Binance Swap, and the rest. And we have example of C5, which is centralized finance. We talk about Binance, Bitrex, Coinbase, Odoni X, Bitfinex, KuCoin, Bobi, ProBit, and all of those cryptocurrency exchanges, they are categorized under centralized finance, which is C5. Now, these are the benefits of um, DeFi, financial inclusion. Financial inclusion, which means equal opportunity are given for everybody, everybody to access the different financial products. Like I said earlier, like Binance have done for us, we have equal opportunity to participate in the different DeFi projects that Binance offers. So it offers complete financial inclusion that offers equal opportunity to everybody, be it that you are rich or you are an average person or your hand is a little bit down. Now we have the second one is global access. That means you can access it from anywhere in the world. You don't need any restriction for you know a particular country and all that. You can access any DeFi platform from anywhere in the world. That's what it means. And the third one is private and permissionless. It's so private to you as a person, for example, if you Binance is not private, reason being that they know your you are information, all your data is with them and all that. But when it comes to um, DeFi platform like Uniswap and all, all of those, is private. No one is with your information. No one is with your information and it is permissionless. You don't need permission from anyone. You don't need permission, no KYC, nothing, nothing. You can do anything you want to do on those platforms without permission. If you want to do anything on Binance, you have to seek for Binance permission. Let's say, for example, you want to launch a coin. So you want to do Binance launch pad. You have to go through processes in which Binance have to verify you and all that before you'll be allowed to list a coin or, you know, go through the IC I E O on Binance. So that's very important. So it is permissionless and private. Now, no KYC. When it comes to DeFi platforms, no KYC. You don't have to do any KYC at all. So it is a very, you know, big thing so that you will stay with your own data. I will have my own data and nobody will be in control of our data. Then the fifth one is liquidity. It has a whole lot of liquidity since it has global access financial inclusion and is permissionless and no KYC. It has a huge liquidity that have that helps it you know have a whole lot of trading volume. A whole lot of trading volume. If you go to Uniswap right now you will discover that the volumes in which is being the volume of trade that is going on on Uniswap is very very big. Reason being that no KYC private and permissionless global access and financial inclusion leads to you know high liquidity and high trading volume on those DeFi exchanges so now in a moment i'm going to go to uh, my binance account right now and then show you how to stake your DeFi token step by step process on how you can stake your DeFi tokens so that you can benefit from it massively without trading these are some things that binance have put together for us to you know take advantage of without you know trading per se so here is the guy when you log into your binance account i have already logged in here to my binance account and then what you need to do is you go to finance when you get to finance you go to binance end you click on binance end Let's go Binance and you see flexible term, fixed term, and high risk product. If you go down, if you go down, you see DeFi is taken. You see DeFi is taken. Now, these are the various products that Binance offer when it comes to DeFi is taken. Now, you have to choose the one that is um, suitable for you, and then you stake is very very simple it's very very simple so let's say for example i want to stake 
my Bitcoin. Remember, it depends on the coin you want to stake. That doesn't mean that you must actually use that particular, you know, uh, DeFi coin to stake on the exchange. You will use Bitcoin to stake in that very product. I hope you get what I mean. Now, so if you click on stake here, let's say for, for example, BTC. So what you have to do is you have to look at the one that have the highest um, APY, that is annual percentage yield. For example, in this case, the ones that have high, highest APY is um, BUSD and USDT. So you can actually, you know, click on the stake. Like, so if I click here, stake BTC, for example, it will take me to this very interface. To take on this interf interface, so you see redemption period one day, interest period one day, and then the APY, you see the APY that you'll be getting as well. Now, two things is very, very important here. You have to check whether the product is sold out or not. The product is sold out. If the product is sold out, then there is no need for you to stick in this very product again. So you have to check for another product that is not, you know, sold out. So if I go down, if I see, okay, this, all these products have been sold out. And then we see here, you can click here, stick, that is we have the AI, the AI. So you click stick. So once you click stick, this is the interface you see. You see flexible and locked. Now flexible means that you can, you know, stake your coin and then also unlock it the next day. That is, you can unlock it anytime you like, but just know that you are dividend. That's your return to be given to you directly after every one day. Okay. So you can stake today and decide not to stake again. That is on stake tomorrow and you still get reward for that period of time where you stake your coin. So that is flexible. Remember, flexible um staking does not have high return like that so if you have if you click on lock if you click on lock you see duration you want to lock it for seven days you want to lock it for 30 days and then if you come here as well you see the summary of how the dates of stake the value the, the interest period interest end dates redemption period and then redemption date as well everything is being Listed. So you have to go through the summary and then ensure you click this and then you put the amount of die that you have in your balance. In this case, I don't have any die in my wallet, so it won't go even though I click confirm purchase. It won't go because I don't have any die in my wallet. So this is all you need to do. You just have to choose 7 days or 30 days if you want to, you know, participate in the locked staking and then you click confirm purchase plan. If you need flexible staking, then the same thing, just click on flexible and then you click, um, you have to agree to the terms and conditions of the staking service agreement and then you confirm purchase as well. Now, one thing that is very important is that you must note the minimum amount that goes for these staking products. That is this very particular product that is still on uh, on the staking wrong. Okay, we have we saw other ones that have been sold out when we look at the other um, the other interface. So we have here hundred die. So this is um, hundred thousand die. This is the maximum and this is the minimum. So you, for you to participate in this very particular one, you must have at least hundred die before the transaction will go that is before you confirm your purchase that is very very simple so just a click of the mouse and when you are sleeping coin will be dropping in your account now how does the payment go do you are being paid directly into your sport wallet into your sport wallet so anything you accumulate will be transferred into your sport wallet you don't need to do anything all you need to do is to stake the coin by following this process and that's that that's just all now if you click on lock uh, staking and you choose seven days or 30 days now at the end of 30 days let's say for example every of your interest 
all your interest within a period of 30 days will be accumulated and then it will be transferred into your spot wallet. Very, very simple. You don't have to do any transfer. Binance automatically transfer it is already you know, written in their algorithm. So that's very, very simple. So this is how you stick DeFi coins in on the Binance exchange. It's very, very simple. So this is another way that you can actually earn um, coins while sleeping. Very, very important. Now, one of the things I want to talk about before in this section is when you are staking, you have to consider the kind of staking you are doing. Very important because the reason why you have to do that is because um, some some staking goes with BTC as we, as we, we see some goes with stable coin. It is advisable because if you go the one with BTC and BTC is dropping, the value of BTC there will be dropping, but you still be receiving your commission now. If you go with stable coin, it won't drop. Stable coin don't drop, it will increase, but you'll be receiving your commission. The only advantage with Bitcoin or raising uh, BNB is because if it is rising, it will be rising as well. I mean, the one you stick will be rising with the rise of Bitcoin or BNB as the case may be. Then if it is dropping as well, it will be dropping also, but your commission will be given to you as stated in the agreement that is every monday and you can unstake and stick again anytime you like so one more thing ensure you do your own research because when you're participating on DeFi staking DeFi products are very high risk products that is why you see one in the they are very high risk products and it is advisable for you to you know painstakingly choose the one you want to participate in and participate in it and then ensure you bear the risk yourself. And also, it is very advisable you do your own research on the very product or project that you want to stick as well so that you don't end up you know, in, in the loss. But from experience, there is no how you be in the loss when it comes to you know, sticking example if you are using you know these stable coins they're using these stable coins there is no how you'll be in the loss it's not possible so that is that guys so ensure you subscribe to the channel if you like the creative content we are giving out share the video to your colleagues to your friends and ensure you smash that like button and then if you have any question check in the description below you will see my contacts if you want one-on-one -on -one mentorship section also contact me via the whatsapp contact in the description below and then you see my link there on Binance and register. Thank you very much guys for watching. I will see you in the next video.